Yo, how's it going, my fellow catfishians? This is Cause Legion Kata speaking, and welcome to your very next five minute review, more or less, of a game called 20 Minutes Till Dawn. A game by Flane, I'm assuming is what it says. Either way. So, if anyone's seen a game called uh, Vampire Survivors, um, so 20 minutes till midnight is sort of like that. Uh, basically, you choose your hero that you want to play as. In this case, you have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And then you can also choose the weapon that you want to use within the run. So you also have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 weapons. Um... And the point is, is literally to survive for 20 minutes. Uh, so you go into your game. The idea is simply to survive for 20 minutes as a horde of enemies comes in rushing you. And um, you either you win or you lose. The amount of things that you do, like the longer you survive, the more you kill, the, lo the, the bigger the level that you gain, the more money that you get in order to... Uh, buy things so for example you gain these things whatever these things are called i'm assuming they're called runes because that's what this thing says but i have no idea and uh runes is what you use in order to either improve your character or in order to buy characters so for instance you don't start with every single weapon and every single character um, you, you start with Shauna in this case, and you start with the revolver. And then you have to unlock everything else via runes. Now, I'm not going to click on the runes uh, tab, but basically the runes tab is the thing that you use in order to upgrade your character. So, for example, when you go into the run, um, you, you'll start with buffs. Or, you know, passives that you can then use within the run, obviously. Uh, in order to upgrade yourself or in order to buy an upgrade, again, you need to use runes. And the cool thing about the game is when you choose your character and you choose your weapon and then you choose play, you have standard... You have standard and quick play. So for example, standard is just, again, you survive for 20 minutes and quick play is you only have to survive for 10 minutes, but you gain XP faster due to the fact that you're only playing for half the amount of time. And what's even better that Vampire Survivor does not do is, as you can tell, each character shows like what darkness level that you ended up completing. So for example, Abby has darkness clear to level 9, and both Diamond and Shauna have a clear of 15. 15 is your highest darkness that you have. So for example, and only for this example, it shows right there that darkness 15 bosses attack more often. So obviously as you are doing the run, um, bosses and mini bosses will appear throughout and in this case the darkness 15 makes the bosses attack more often than they would normally and the higher you go the harder it is um, and if you're wondering each character has their own ability so the reason why I'm highlighting these is because you can see uh, who the character is and what they can do um, without even having to buy it, which is good. Same thing goes for the weapons. So, for example, Shauna can uh, reroll upgrades once per level, and Diamond starts with very high HP. So there you can see that Shauna starts with 7, uh, Diamond starts with 7, Shauna starts with 4, Scarlet's with 3, and Scarlet, every third shot, throws a wave of fire that burns enemies for 3 damage per second. So, anyways... I would have to say, if you want to compare, which you probably should, uh, this game with Vampire Survivors, it just kind of feels like this game, um, like its atmosphere is more original. The weapons and uh, the abilities that each person has is more original than 
um the vampire survivors for me vampire survivors kind of feels like it's trying to rip up something off but obviously it does its own thing so it's not necessarily a complete rip off it's just more like uh you can easily compare that with uh castlevania for example which is not bad but just in general um now you can the pros and cons of each game uh for and another thing is when it comes to uh, 20 minutes till dawn. Um, when it comes to 20 minutes till dawn, th there as of right now, there's only one level. So if you do happen to want to play this game because it is an early access, it only has one level. It also feels like the game is a little bit less RNG than Vampire Survivors, for example. Like, when you start the rounds, you know what's going to come at you. You know at what point things are going to come at you. You even know what kind of bosses will come at you. Uh, there aren't too many upgrades, I guess you can say. So, you kind of know what upgrades you're going to want once you play the game, but... At, at first, um, choosing choosing the things that you want will obviously come slowly. I, I, my only complaint about the game is not that there's only one level. It's more like there is a passive that you can get in the rune shop called uh, Glass Cannon. So, for example, I can't... 100% remember what glass cannon does but glass cannon uh, makes you start with half the HP and it also and its buff would be it does more damage and you can attack faster and the reason why I don't feel like that specific item is appropriate I guess you can say for the game is because you can just re heal up the HP that you have lost if you can survive long enough and obviously if you know how to survive long enough to be able to even get to that point um so i feel like the cons of glass cannon are not as heavy as they should be um but literally other than that one item i don't really feel like the game's all that bad it, it's really fun um obviously you have to play for 20 minutes so if you start a run you have to start for 20 minutes you can press pause simply by pressing escape or probably even start on the controller but i play on keyboard so there's that and um yeah that's that's about it there isn't too many cons when it comes to the game but then again it is very early access so if you are wondering right there 20 minutes till dawn shoot down an ever-growing horde of lo of lovecraftian monsters to survive the night choose from a variety of upgrades to create unique and game-breaking builds oh, well there you go game-breaking builds that's actually one of the complaints that i had in a sense but i mean the game literally tells you so there you go unlock a diverse cast of characters weapons with unique powers so the game was released 8th of June of this year. Uh, developers and publishers by Flane, Flane, and uh, also E-Rabbit. So, there you go. Um, I do suggest if you enjoyed Vampire Survivors to also check out 20 Minutes Till Dawn. Just understand that it is early access. Um... There are game-breaking builds, but apparently the game already told you that. So even though the one complaint that I had for Glass Cannon is a complaint, due to the fact that the developers already mentioned that there's game-breaking builds, it doesn't matter. But I'm sure things will end up getting fixed as time goes by. And um, also, this game just feels a little bit more original than Vampire Survivors. But like any other game out there, due to the fact that assuming vampire survivor was the first game that either did what it does or if it ended up being the first popular one of its genre 
everything afterwards is kind of just going to feel like a copycat. So, you know, take it as you will. But if I were to give this game right now a grade, I would definitely give it a 7.5 out of 10. I definitely feel like it's well worth the money. It is well worth uh, checking it out. And there's um, obviously completionists when it comes to um, trying to beat Darkness 15, which as of right now is the max darkness for the game for each character as well as for each weapon. And uh, if you are like me, a completionist, and you like just, you know, getting goals done within games, I would say this game is definitely worth it for you. But if, uh, if you enjoyed this, let me know. And if you didn't, also let me know. Hopefully, I'll get more reviews out there uh, every Friday. And um, hope to see you in the next one. Take care.